Today I want to show how to set Maya up using Max's set flow or something similar to set flow in Max. I'm just going to quickly make a box here. For it to editable poly, and we want to put some swift loops in here. Okay, and if anybody's familiar with this, you know what set flow does. Set flow is going to equal this edge flow in between this line, this edge line, and that edge line. And then the set flow is right here in max. And you can see how it just pops it right over there. Perfect. And I'm going to hit control Z and go back. And I have mine set up to a hotkey as the end key. And it does the same thing, pops right over there. We can do this edge line, make it even, boom. It's an excellent tool. Okay, so how do we do it in Maya? The box. And we need to uh, put some edge loops in here. Okay, so say we want to make this edge dead center in between this edge loop and this edge loop. So to find it, it's in Edit Mesh, and it's right here under Edit Edge Flow. And I got my hotkey set to the end key. And if we hit that, it pops it right over in the middle. It's awesome. So what happens if the lines ain't perfect? Let's say that it's crooked or something, or we're on, you know, something that's not square. It could be round, anything. It works. It works for anything. So we'll pull that vertice over and what it's going to do is it's going to average out between this crooked line and this straight line and put it right in the middle. So I'm going to go ahead and use my hotkey this time. Same thing. Puts it right there. Perfect. Very handy tool. And I will show you quickly. We'll go up where it's at in the hotkey menu. Settings, hotkey editor. And it's pretty cool because we know that it's in the mesh tools, or I'm sorry, edit mesh. We know it's in that edit mesh. So we come over here and we're going to go to menu items and we'll scroll down to, oops, we'll buy it right here, edit mesh. And then um, right here it is, edit edge flow. And I programmed it to a hotkey. Okay, we'll see you all next time.